Sean Baker is back. And I knew that Anora was going to be an exciting and honest interpretation of a very different type of story from his previous films. Anora is a fantastic film, and I think it's one of the top five of the year, easily. It's hot off its um, Cannes Palme d'Or win, and I think it's going to be a very strong contender going forward into the main awards season. Naturally, I was prepared to take all the hype with a pinch of salt. Yet, I was hooked from the start and welcomed all the typical little Sean Bakerisms. My favourite being the panic-saturated searching around town trying to find Ivan. I think also the soundtrack was very, very Sean Baker. I loved it. The Greatest Day was a great choice. Mikey Madison really shines in this film as a sassy dancer slash sex worker who doesn't take shit from anyone. Her most famous previous role was in Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, which I have to admit I don't remember. In Anora, this definitely won't happen. She's beyond memorable. I think that every decision in every scene has been made to strengthen her character and choices. And sometimes subtle and sometimes less subtle, to say the least. The film is not about the world or the plot or morals or anything like that. It's 100% about Anora. Amazing accomplishment by Sean Baker, I think, is very confident filmmaking to rely so heavily on one character and one actress. All the side characters are great, as they support the understanding of Nora so well. Ivan is perfectly portrayed as a spoiled brat who is charming but very far from maturity or independence. We're not here to judge him. He's there for us to ask why Nora is even entertaining this relationship. Of course, money is one reason, but we haven't really been exposed to Nora being in serious financial difficulties early in the film or anything like that. She, I think that she thinks that she's doing what she's supposed to want without asking herself the hard questions about self-worth, identity, and she's driven, but kind of without ambition in a weird way. And I think there's a um, sense of um, certain sense of what, is, what are we supposed to do with this life? You just end up somewhere and you just stay there, and when you're given uh, a way out, do you take it or should you ask other questions instead? Like maybe you should be doing something completely different with your life. 